interesting phenomenon in, that we find in nature, there's a tendency for engineers to want to harness it. And so indeed, that's what we do with uncertainty. We have uses for uncertainty that are truly breathtaking. Uh, for example, in, in, um, in my lab, we, we, we try to fail a million times a day. And what I mean by that is that NASA and the Apollo project, their motto was failure is not an option. But what we do is we try to make a million shots on goal that are, they're not random, but they're slightly biased, um, but they're diverse. And so we make what are called libraries, which libraries, libraries is really not the right metaphor, but I share it anyway, because that's what we call them. They're collections of semi-random molecules, DNA, RNA, protein, whatever, and you test them for function. And you're looking for that needle in a haystack that you're sort of engineering serendipity where you can get something to be of value to medicine or agriculture or, or curiosity. So that, that is, that's my ode to uh, uh, serendipity, well, to uncertainty, <laughs> is that uh, idea of failing a million times a day, hopefully succeeding once or twice. <laughs>